Hey YouTubers, Koga959 here. Today we have a Pokemon Sword and Shield Elite Trainer Box. Now I haven't done a review video. I've collected some of this set. I, read, I think I've already opened two of these, I believe, on my own. But for all you new, for all you new to the channel, um, I do also do guitar stuff and all that. But what rocks about these is that eight packs separators, bunch of energies, the uh, entire manual for all the cards that you can collect in the set, get yourself set up with some sleeves, so the uh, rather than those plastic um, poison burn counters, you got, got the special edition dice in the box itself. So I want to let you guys know that while I'm doing this, I'm going to be switching hands because I'm holding the camera in one hand, I'm going to be doing the review and the the same time, so so I'll this baby open. I'm just gonna set the camera down for a sec. All right, ev all right, everyone, we are back. If the camera would just focus for, for a few seconds, uh, I'll focus on this own. But anyways, uh, I did manage to get this thing, oh, get the uh, Elite Trainer box open. So we say, we take a look. Now that right there, I it kind of reminds me of the uh, no people kind of call me out on this one that when I say it looks like kind of like traditional uh, playing cards with the king like logo, with the sword and everything. But I heard the game got some pretty bad reviews from some trainers. But I played it. I'm halfway through the game right now, and I'd have to say the game isn't that bad. It's kind of repetitive, but. Other than that, it's, it was pretty cool. It is pretty awesome. The sleeves, which are pretty cool. I didn't really like what Pokemon did, just having the logo on it originally. So when they just did the image to represent the Sword Legendary, I think they really stepped up their game. Okay. Then your package of energies, which will become very useful, considering you get energies per pack, and then the code card if anybody wants to use it i just collect them which in in some leagues in like madison and pegasus games i got a few buddies that would consider them currency so what do you say we pop, pop these babies open let me see if i can find something to hold the camera unless i can somehow hold oh I should just use my knees <laughs> First pack. I don't really do the three cards in the back thing, so we just get into it. Ball Toy, Wooloo, Joltik, Solandit, Clavopus, Marnie, don't have that one yet, Cloyster, Water Energy, very useful, Pokegear 3.0, Sudoudo, Eldicross, if I pronounce that right, then the code card for that pack. Which you will uh, chime in with us if you see this, you know you didn't get a those like V those uh, Pokemon EX GX or Pokemon V cards or V Maxes. Um, you always want to check the back of your code card every time you get up every time you open a pack, so you can actually get so you can know right away you got something good. Yeah, that's actually something we did back in the high school, but those days are over. So even if we didn't get get like something like. Okay, get ready to focus. There we go. Sizzlipede. Galar. Muna. Snom. Grookey. Good starter. Lumberry. Poltergeist. Oh, that's nice. Fighting Energy. Mantine. Crushing Hammer. They brought that back. And now it's brought back Switch. Which is actually very useful because now... You can use any, which I believe if Matt, Matt, Matt Harrington, like he and I used to play it all the time, but he said that basically if that card goes back, it's relevant that any other Switch or Crushing Hammer that was made in, in previous sets would become relevant. I don't know if that's still the case, but there it goes. I hate it when the packs do that, don't you? Comment below if you ever experienced that. Again. 
Uh, Galar Zigzagoon, Gusslifer, Silicobra, Yomper, Krabby, Nikit, Syndrance, Fire Energy, Seeking, Thwacky, and Lucky Egg. So far, we've gotten some trainer cards I don't already have in the set. So, if anybody knows, um, I'm running a Zacian. I don't know how to. I think it's Zach. Is that Sassian Zacian? Uh, but I'm running the Steel type Legendary in this deck that's on the cover of this. But um, apparently, the card's really hard to pull. So if you guys know any, know any good. Sorry, camera timed out, but. If you have any good uh, parts that go with it, let me know. Hero Seed. 